Hey YouTube, how the heck we doing? We're kicking off season 14, showing you what I think will be the best build this season for AP. There's also an on-hit best build. We'll get to that later. So I think the best AP build this season will be Sork Boots, which is different because it was Berserker Greaves last season. Sork Boots, Nasher, Storm Surge. This item looks too damn good to be true so we want to center our builds around this item ap magic and move speed so this has magic pen sork boots are now better because sork boots has magic pen last season magic pen was crap this season it's not so we want to synergize storm search sork boots that's 30 magic pen still need the nashers for the attack speed yo set chill um, so Nashor Storm Surge, that's our core with those work boots. After that, all our items are situational, right? If they're tanky, we can go Leandres. If they're squishy, we can go Shadow Flame. If we need Zanyas, we can go Zanyas. If we have Infernal Drakes, we can go Death Cap. If they have Magic Resist, we can go Void Staff. Um, Cosmic Drive, if we want to go Shroom Focus. Everything else is situational. Got the blind off huge. Everything else is situational, but the Storm Surge and Sork Boots are not. And the Nashor's Tooth is not. I still think Nashor's Tooth will be really valuable. For my runes, again, a little situational, but Prestige Attack still is going to be the, the best early game rune page, right? Like, damn near every lane you verse, you can get the Prestige Attack procs off. Ah, oh, this is going to hurt. I got the blind off, though. Pretty much every... Okay, we're good. Nice, he mistimed his combo. Pretty much every lane, just like that, every lane... Even if it's a cannon, a set, you can usually get press the attack off. So I still think that would be the best room page. But Nashers will give us the attack speed we need. See, the difference is, see the difference already. We're not going Berserkers anymore because Magic Pen becomes that much valuable with Storm Surge being broken. But press the attack still looking good. Okay, anywho, let's game. Secondary, you can kind of go whatever you want. I went Absolute Focus Gathering Storm just as a, as a universal good room page. But really, it's up to you. So this is what I think will be the best build. It has good early game strength with the Nashers, with the Sword Boots, with the Press the Attack. It has good scaling strength with the Storm Surge and all the goodies. Again, Teemo just got better this season, right? Look at this item. 100 AP, 12 Magic Pen, 5 Move Speed. Everything Teemo wants. Believe it or not, you don't need mana on Teemo. Mana is a wasted resource on Teemo. You don't need that much. We have Presence of Mind will be good enough. You go E, you max W second. You don't need to max Q. So look at all his bis items. All these items don't have mana on them. W mana is a waste of resource. So Swarm Surge, AP, Magic Pen, Move Speed, all really good for Teemo. If you look at the new Leandres, health instead of mana, beautiful. If you look at new Shadow Flame, AP, Magic Pen, no mana, right? Mana is a, a wasted resource. That's also why I'm not going Caster's Companion. If you guys have been paying attention to the Season 14 items, Caster's Companion is a new Ludens. And Malignance is a Shroom build, but again, I don't think you need manas, and I don't think Shroom build is going to be that good. So, this is my best AP build for Season 14. Keep up with the times or get dropped. Get left behind. He has no shield, right? All right, nice. He just got called with his pants down. He's not putting respect on the Season 14 Tenmo. No respect. I'm actually going to go ahead and play like a human being. I'm going to freeze this wave here. Because, like, you know, I could just disrespect him and push the wave and be an animal. But I think I actually want to play proper here. So we get this freeze, and that's proper. I still have that potion, too. Okay, so now we're just chilling, right? Now we're in such a good spot. It's frozen. I can fumble the bag. If he flashes on me, he can actually just pulverize my meat. Um, if I play bad and catch his punch to the face combo, I can die. But if we just play decently, I think we're looking real good. Especially when I get my level 6 here. Because he has to shove it out, right? See, he has to use his shield to shove it out. Now he leaves himself open. Yeah, he's dead. This guy has no respect for the Tenmo powers. Oh, I used that ward a little too quick. Okay, I think he still dies. Okay. See, no respect for the Tenmo. Brother, I do a lot of damage in Season 14. But that's what a good freeze causes, right? And of course, right, we're playing for screen challenger players. You know me, I only play with the best of the best, so. Okay, that's, I mean, that's a great leaning phase. See, again, right? I am not going Berserker Grease because I think Swork Boots are so much more value. So much more value now since Swarm Surge is in the game. So we're going to go Swork Boots. Still going to get the attacks with though. We still press the attack. A little different, a little different, but. 
Boom, boom, boom. So, yeah, look at all the new items, right? Season 14, baby. So, again, I was commenting on Ludens Companion. AP Mana Haste, and you get the Ludens proc. Also on Malignance, it's the new Shroom build, right? AP Mana Haste, Ultimate Haste, and then you create a zone for your Shroom. I think if you want to go Shroom build, that's fine, but I really don't find Shroom builds that viable. I don't think they're best, right? The thing with Teemo is that you can kind of build anything you want, but there is layers to it, right? There is builds that are just clearly better than others. If you want to listen to me, hell yeah. If you don't, that's fine. I ain't judging. Oh, I'm dead. I'm not dead. Yo, that Shivana, that... She came out of nowhere. She came out of nowhere, did she not? Okay, we got to carry this one. It's carryable, though. I'm fed. And season 14 items are a little wild and nutty. Shivana should be here, right? Reporting in. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah, that Shivana just threw her fireball. I'm down. I can help you, actually. Let's do, let's do the Void Nuggets. Let's do the Void Nuggets. I got you, bro. Bro, this guy doesn't have Smite, so he's going all the way to his red? I'm being trolled or what? An enemy has been slain. Action's our jungler. Kane's our mid laner. They did a little uh, razzle-dazzle. It's fine. I didn't want the... I'm going to go ward... I, I don't... These Void Nuggets are so incredibly broken. I don't want to give them over for no reason. These are the season 14 void nuggets. So if you kill them, you do more damage to the turret. If you get five stacks, which is two two respawns of it, you spawn things on the turret. It's pretty cool stuff. I mean, this guy's dead, right? I'm just saying, ignite him so it goes to the shield. Honestly, the poison might have been enough to finish him, but I want better safe than sorry. All right, we'll get a little platy poo and then look at split. Kane mid action jungle, the old reversal. <laughs> That's called the bean boozle. Okay, Nashers. Nashers did get a slight buff, I suppose. 10 EP, right? Season 13, it was 80. Season 14, 90. Slight buff. How much gold does it cost? Is it 3,000 or 32? It's 3,000. Wait, so big buff. No, season 13, it's 100 AP. Season 14, it's 90 AP, but 200 gold less. I mean, that's certainly a buff for Teemo, because Teemo, you don't need, you don't stack AP. I'd rather have the full item. So it costs 200 less gold and has 10 AP less. I think that's actually a net buff for Teemo specifically, although it doesn't really matter, right? I think I'm going to go to the Void Nuggets myself, personally. I heard they hit like a truck, but I mean, I'm playing Teemo. I have a shroom. Like, can't I just go do them? Let's see. Let's find out. Season 14, baby. I'm going to get my stealth passive because, like I said, I do think these things hit like a truck. Get my shroom down. Get them all autoed. Holy cannoli. Okay. Well, I mean, worst case scenario, we get one of them. Um... Yeah, I think I'll leave. I don't think you can do them. I think you need to be the jungler. Oh, one gold, Bog. Yeah, I, I don't think I, you know, I'll be honest. I don't think that was worth it. <coughs> I'll be honest. Uh, season 14, you cannot do those. You cannot soul those as the young Teemo. I'll be real with you. All right, I'm going to go try and do another one. I'm going to do one more before I base. <laughs> I am trolling it, aren't I? If I could time my shroom well, I think we might be able to not die. Okay. I'm dead. <clears throat> anyway, I'm just testing it. I was just testing the damage for y'all. Don't don't worry about it. I got my Nashers. I had to base anyway, to be honest. i am be real with you guys. I had to base anyway, so I was just testing it for you guys. No worries. Thank you later. Yeah, I think you have to have the jungle item to do that. I'll be honest. I missed one wave for it. That's fine. That's worth the limit test, right? Right. Can you get these damn void nuggets action? Do your job. You're the jungler. Go get the objectives. Go get the void nuggies. I got Swords and my uh, Nashers, so we're looking good. I mean, I'm looking good. LeBlanc's looking better, but I'm still looking good. 
Bro, action is not. He like really is purposely not getting the void nuggets. I'm confused. Oh, I mean this guy's still dead, right? Cause he, I slowed him on my shroomy. I got another one there. Nice. I mean, Kane's one and five sets zero and five. I believe in Arcane more than their set. It just will come down to me versus LeBlanc. Obviously, she has an advantage, right? She's a 7 0 LeBlanc versus Teemo. LeBlanc kind of counters Teemo because she could literally one shot me. But I mean, what if we pull it off? How epic would that be? What if we just kill her? Hey, look, I have the one thing. Look, I did. I, I killed one of them, so I get a little bonus true damage. That's the void. That's the void nugget. I don't know what their actual name is. I just call them void nugget. This is why I think Storm Surge second will be good because Timo need like Timo doesn't spawn in with a million damage, right? You can't spawn in and one shot anybody. So like LeBlanc can go Storm Surge first because she full combos and doinks, but Timo cannot. And that's okay. I think that's totally okay. Well, they got Molly Womped, didn't they? That's a Molly Womping. If I ever seen one, holy kahoot! All right, well. <laughs> It's not looking as good anymore. It was looking winnable. After that, it's not looking as winnable. I'll be honest. But I'm down. What if we win? How epic would that be? What if we just win? I'm going to go kill the Void Nuggets. I'm getting them. I don't care. I don't care if I die. I'm not going to die. Oh. Hey. Be gone. I'm killing one of these. I don't care. I'll, I don't care if I, if I get one at a time. It's all ploy just gets set to fight me. Look, I'll just say one at a time, baby. Slow and steady. Oh, he was trying to... Nice, he took aggro. Can I actually get the other one now? <laughs> one at a time. Slow and steady wins the race. What can I say? <laughs> Listen, if action's not going to get the void nuggets, I will, okay? If he's not going to get them, I will. I don't care if I have to die for him. so not worth it it's so not worth it i'll be honest i'm i'm asking you to die aren't i i think i'll base i'll be honest i think i'll get out of here i got the void nuggets i mean it's winnable be honest guys is it winnable it's winnable it is herald spawning we got three void nuggets that's that helps true dot to the tower nine damage each second for four seconds it's not bad it's free too well a kill is a kill Eventually I'll group and I'll start dominating. I just, I always top lane. You always want to get that turret before you move. I would have got the turret by now if I wasn't messing around with the void nuggets, but I'm gonna have to give that a worth. If they can hold off LeBanc for a second, so I can get first turret, that'd be actually huge. <coughs> Wait, it's big, winnable. <sighs> Damn, Shivana also showed mid. They get first turret, Sag. I still get the bounty on mine. Unless they come up here now and kill me. Um, I messed up. Okay, I didn't, he's dead. He went a little too early. I'm pretty sure Shimon is coming, but it's fine. Oh, it's not fine, guys. I'll be honest, it's not fine. Holy crap. I got Storm Surged. She has 24 stacks and Storm Surge. I think she's a little more fed than I am. It was not fine. I did the report, it was not fine. Still winnable though. Listen, if I kill her once, we win. If, oh. Honestly. <laughs> every, every time I type winnable, we get aced bot lane. Is it a me? Is it me? Every time I type winnable, literally the entire team dies. Is it me? I mean, if you think about it, Set's going to AFK, right? And we're going to win? What if Set just AFKs and we win? How's that sound? Set's 0-6. Do we have anybody 0-6? No, we don't. Hmm? How about that? We didn't think about that one, did you, Chief? So technically, it's a 4v5. We win. 
Although LeBlanc, I think, counts for two champions at the moment. Yes, Do you believe in the power of Tenmo? I get this, we get a bounty, and I get my uh, 950 for Storm Surge. Look at that gold. Look at that bounty. We get a Storm Surge, and I have the same amount of items as LeBlanc. Oh, she's trolling. She went Malignance in her build. We win. That's not good for LeBlanc. 20 ultimate haste. And if you ult them, it leaves a ground beneath. I don't. I feel like that doesn't make sense for LeBlanc. So I think we win. All right, we go group now. We got the turret. We go group. <clears throat> LeBlanc's going to beat me there, but maybe I can do some, some theatrics. I have flash. Now my storm surge is online, so I can flash and kill somebody. Oh, LeBlanc's not here. This actually looks really good then. Hey, I'm down. I'm down to chase. LeBlanc's here. Um, no, no, no. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay, it's chill. Whoo. That Shivana lasted way longer than I thought. I'm going to vote no on that one. I'm going to vote no on that one, Chief. Hey. This is winnable. I'm just saying. All right, we're going to go perma battle. We're, we're duking it out bot lane. Hey, set is AFK. Look, we made set AFK. Set AFK winnable. I don't know when he's going to come back. I think he'll come back soon. And when he does come back, we're screwed. But for now, it's winnable. We're pulling our team to victory. And again, right? We're looking good. LeBlanc's fed. I'm just as fed. I just have to somehow get the jump on her without being able to jump. I'm assuming I'm on a ward, so I'm taking this angle. Maybe we look for LeBlanc and Siobhan instead. At least get some shrooms down. All right, that's huge. When in doubt, just go bottom. All right, I just cannot fall asleep at the wheel. I got to make sure I kill LeBlanc. There she is. I have the Void Nuggets as well. Huge winnable. Okay, I am the LeBlanc Kryptonite. <laughs> that's how we're playing this one. We have presence of mind, so we won't go oom either. Dude, this LeBlanc's scary. If this was Bobkin on LeBlanc, I think we, we all die and we lose. Do we have anything for her? I'm down. I'm down. We either get one shot or one shot her. Oh, shnikes. That's fine. Reporting in. You just wait till I have. Ooh, ooh. Let's go. She's dead. Storm surge. Boom. Winnable. We surged her. We surged her, baby. Either I, I think I, I either get, I get 30 gold. If the damage on storm surge doesn't go through, you get 30 gold. So it's like, dude, this item is just stacked. So if you kill them with the damage, you get 500 gold because you get a kill. And if you were going to kill them already, you get 30 gold. It's just like a compensation for being a beast. Vex, what are we doing here? Get back. Surge? Get surged? To get surged? She did get surged. I'm just saying. See, every time I do 35% of the max health damage, which is totally possible, I get 20, 25% movement speed and 230 damage. That's, like, this item is just insanely stacked. Okay, I think we go Shadow Flame. They're, they are not building any MR. Like, I could go Banshees or Sablanc. That feels like a waste. So I think it's Shadow Flame. I just try and fight fire with fire. I mean, she could one-shot me easily, so I got to put respect on her name. I can't be the first one in. I'm sorry. I wish I could. Yeah, see, that, that would be me if I was the first one in. Yeah, I think... <laughs> Can't hold to the wrong one, poor soul. I'm down to just go pick on Varus. That's fine. He is a shutdown on him. Oh, he's got a lot of tankiness. Titanic Hydra Bork. Oh, oh, oh. This looks pretty good. Oh, nice slash. Uh, I'm just gonna run at him. Are we surging? 
We surged. We surged, baby. Look at the scaling on this, too. 258 magic damage. <coughs> that AP scaling is nuts. 15 second cooldown, it's nothing. Like I said, this item, if you're playing full AP Teemo and manage to get fed, like you can proc this a lot more reliable. I think that's better off mid lane and jungle, though, to be honest. Full AP. Ooh. Oh, nice. After Baron spawns, if your team does a buff, your whole team gets it. I forgot about that. Ideally, you either go a build where you can practice. Yeah, you just have to get to that point with Teemo where you can do 35% damage and you're good. Which is very... That's reasonable. Teemo does a lot of damage, right? <coughs> I think I pushed this and then... Um, we go boom. Boom, boom, pow. I can kill him. Titanic Hydra is fine. So I, I go Shadow Flame because they have no magic resist. And Shadow Flame's going to help me get there. Then I think I go either Death Cap or Void. Oh, shit. Um, yeah, I can't 2v1, guys. I'm out. Sorry. Like, well, yeah, I can't 2v1. No shot. Yo, that hurt. Ma'am, I'm out. I mean, I could one-shot Varus. He used everything earlier. Although I'm on a ward, but I'm down. Um, it was close. It was close. Oh, if I bought that earlier, he might have died. I, mi I misplayed. I could have flashed blindly. I didn't think he had ult up again, to be honest. I didn't think he had ult up one. I could have bought the alternator quicker, too. And I could have flashed blindly three. Do I get an assist still? That's oh, okay. We'll allow it. We'll allow it. Still a lot of damage. A lot of damage with one auto, which is wild. Okay, all right. It's winnable still. They didn't do Baron. It's a tough game. We literally made set AFK, but it's still a tough game. Because LeBlanc counts for at least two champs. 14, 1, and 3. Like, I think LeBlanc, new items or not, I think a 14 kill LeBlanc is going to shit on everybody. New items, old items, AD, AP, don't matter. I think 14 kill LeBlanc, she's that girl. But we're, we'll, we'll get her. I'm confident we'll get her eventually. I mean, we literally have five people that have four. We'll get her, right? I'm swarm surging. My swarm surging. Yeah, it went off. Nice. This game's a beast. We'll take it. Another storm surge, Brock, and we get Drake. I'm down for Drake. Hey, we're storm surging, baby. I'm telling you, this item is nuts. 15 second cooldown. 300 damage on a 15 second cooldown, and also scales, right? I'm gonna push bottom here. We have three Void Nuggets, too, so we do true damage to the turret. <coughs> I'm going to shroom this, get it, get it going a little bit quicker. But I really want to get this. Oh, I'm dead. Why did I go back in? I'm a glutton for punishment. Ah, I storm surged her, but she storm surged me. Woo! I'm scaled, baby. We're scaled. I'll give that a smiley face in all chat. Hey, we're going toe to toe with LeBlanc. Look at that, baby. 1K. You do damage, I do damage. You're Storm Surgeon, I'm Storm Surgeon. Um, I go Death Cap, right? I'm pretty sure I'm just going to fight Fire with Fire. I don't think I go Banshees versus Blanc. I don't think that even saves me. So I think I just have to stealth and outplay her. I mean, that dive was questionable. I'll say that. It was questionable to say the least, but it looks like it worked out somehow. We go death cap because that fits our build the most. And like I said, this part of the game is super situational. If they had magic resist, we would go void staff. If they had, you know, a, a one threat, Zanya's would be good. But I think it's just death cap. The, the buff shares now, so I'll do this blue here. Oh, never mind. I won't. I'll kill Shivana. If I was her, I would come back for the Gromp easily. Come to Papa. Come to Daddy-O. All right, I'll come to you. She might one-shot me. I'm not going to lie. Are we storm surging? We are. Okay, huge. Dude, that effect is wild. 
Like, do you need a freaking top of the line PC to play League now with all these item effects or what? Oh, it's bo LeBlanc's bottom, so I'm chilling. I mean, Vex could snag me, but I'm just going to assume she's not here. She's not here. Okay. I'm hoping I can get this turret. I mean, I do it pretty quick. Bold move, Cotton. But we saw Varus and Vex mid lane. And we have the Void Nuggets. I think I take my base, honestly. What's stopping LeBlanc from coming over here? Our team's fighting mid. Oh, well, I'm dead. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, that's fair. Like, to be honest, I deserve that. That's fair. Oh, we died mid as well. Oh, Jurats. Like, I was dying there. I knew that. That was... I. That's fair. I didn't expect us to die mid as well. Dying mid was the, uh... The catch. Ah! Jurats. Hey. It's been an uphill battle all game. That's fine. It's been an uphill battle all game. It's fine. Season 14, nothing's changed. My team's a bunch of inters. Just kidding, just kidding. Haha. <laughs> no, I'm not. We made set go AFK, but we still got a ball game. Who would have thunk it? Worth. We get our death cap here in a sec. LeBlanc has me beat by like two. Like she. Well, she has me beat by a lot, I'll be honest. She's got me beat by like 2,000 gold, maybe even 3,000. But I'm hanging in there. Oh, if we kill her, I can buy my item without without leaving base, right? Nice. Look at that. I needed that ima exact amount of gold. Maybe it's meant to be. 700 AP. Nice. Like, I'm definitely Storm Surgeon. 400 it's doing. Bunk's at 429. I'm fed. She's more fed. I don't think I'm going to personally jump on the Baron, but my team can, and I'll try and kill LeBlanc, right? I think that's the strat here. Oh, shnikes. Oh, nice. I'll catch that. Don't worry, guys. I'll catch that for everybody. Nice. That was good. I played that really well. That was great. I'm happy. I'm happy about that. I walked into it. That was fun. That was good. Good job, Manko. Thanks, Manko. Good job. Nice. Awesome. Epic. Cool. Sweet. I'll catch that Verisaur. Hey, I'm here. I'm in the outfield. Throw it. Am I an idiot or what? Yes, I am. Cool. That's fine. They don't have four drig win cons. So we're chill. Dude, the storm surge item is nuts. The storm surge thing is nuts. It's gonna be the most built item for sure. It's it's cracked out of its mind. Oh, Kawabunga, mate. Oh, set's back. God darn it. That's the set we made AFK. He's back. Ah, Jurats. It's fine. We can win. <laughs> oh no I'm coming Senna you're good though does the set even care does he even want to kill you I got you boom boom maybe it's good that sets back the set come back keep giving us kills welcome back set maybe it's good that he's back all right we get this buff it gives everybody the buff I'm going to save my Q for Miss Vex here. Oh, nice. She hit a shroom. Storm Surge. Surge. Stop it. Ouchies. Oh, we're good. Okay. Varus dies to my team. He does. LeBlanc's bottom. We're chilling. Let's get Baron. LeBlanc's bottom. Let's get Baron. Someone has to tank it that isn't Cold Teemo. And we win. Nice. Hey. Baron, stop hitting me, please. Stop it. LeBlanc gets a kill. That's fine. We get Baron. Okay, it's winnable. LeBlanc has literally one HP down there. Uh, what am I going? Lich Bean? Full burst. Lich Bean? Yeah, I think it's Lich Bean. Again, I really don't see myself getting Banshees this game. Either LeBlanc one-shots me or I one-shot her. They don't have any magic or either. Okay, now they're building MR. So maybe it's a Void Staff pivot. I built the Hextech alternator, but we can honestly sell boots if we want to for Void. That would be the play. Sell boots for Void and we get Lich Bane. Because we have the movement speed from... Um, we have the 5% from Storm, Storm Surge. Then we'll get the Lich Bane movement speed as well. All right, literally, it's like I just have to auto Q Ignite LeBlanc and hope I kill her. Because she obviously can kill me in like one Q. 
She has a Zanyas, but I highly doubt she'll be able to use it in time if I stealth and kill her. Okay, splat, pop goes the weasel. LeBlanc's coming up here. We saw her move from mid lane, so I gotta get ready. So for me to kill LeBlanc, she has to walk into a shroom and I have to auto queue her. <laughs> Otherwise, it's not gonna happen. I think she's in this bush. She was near topside. I'm scared of both bushes. Okay, she's over there. We see her. They hit a shroom. That's good. I think I'll, I think they have to come into us. It's a little worrisome walking into them, to be honest. I avoided the orb. We're waiting for LeBlanc to walk into us. Kane didn't press R in time. Dodged it. I dodged it. It's good. It's fine. I'm going to go top. Holy smokes, man. Tough game. Winnable, though. Freaking raid boss LeBlanc. If I can split and get them to come back for me, that'd be really ideal. They, I mean, LeBlanc could end the game if she plays half decent. She's one-shotting everybody. But also, I could end the game if I play half decent. So I'll go for it. I'm going to go for it here. I'll oh, set you little fucking rat. Can you AFK again? Okay. Well, he's dead. All right. Varus and LeBlanc are pushing. So who can stop me? Shivana? Do we have any TPs? Oh, Vex can. Okay, we got our shield. She has a lot of range, though. Nice, they're not ending. I got inhib, they got inhib. That's pretty even. Okay, chill. We need Void Staff. Wits End and Banshees. Okay, Void Staff. Come to Daddy. So we sell boots, right, for Void? Let's just sell this for Void, and we'll keep it classy for now. I need to stay strong. Okay, so, I mean, in it for inhib, that's pretty worth it, because top inhib is more valuable than mid. I mean, we kill LeBlanc one time, we're looking good. One LeBlanc kill, we're looking good. All right, all right. I mean, we're actually in a spot where it's winnable. <clears throat> did I sneak in here in time? I think I did. But is anybody even going to come over here? Doesn't look like it. Maybe LeBlanc will bring him over here. Nice. Action got red buffs. So we all get it. I'm going to keep pushing. I think I have to be the one to start to press the action. Um... I highly doubt they end the game. I'd be very dumbfounded if they end the game versus my team. They're walking down mid. I would think they're going to come back for me. I don't think they can end, so I'm going to keep pushing. Going to call their bluff. I think they're already coming back for me. Yeah, I agree, team. But I have shroom set up. If they walk into my shroom, we're looking good. Yeah, I'm right here. I may as well collect these. A little free ability haste with those puppies. Um, yeah, Drake's spawning, and they're gonna come here for Drake, and I'm just sitting here, like, like, doing what? Oh, I was spotted. Oh, shit. Okay, I'm out. I mean, I'm down for a team fight, I guess, if we play the team fight decent. Oh, whoa, okay. Settle down. I, I'm waiting for LeBlanc, guys. We gotta wait for LeBlanc. Okay, I'm out. That's one. We'll take the one. We got the one so far. We're not dead. Varus, please die. Okay, that's two. Where's LeBlanc? Oh, no. Okay, it's fine. That's three. Where's LeBlanc? LeBlanc's dead. LeBlanc's dead. We killed LeBlanc somehow. Wait, do we win? Do we have any TPs? Who killed LeBlanc? I didn't even kill LeBlanc. <clears throat> Damn, if we had one TP, we could win the game. Any TPers? Any TPers? I'm already bot lane, so I'm going to keep pushing. Your team has destroyed a turret. Look at that. Look at that freaking... That's the elixir plus the void nuggets. I mean, I would like to get that turret too, but... You, okay, we got that turret. Nice. I got 10 seconds versus these goofballs. Stop it. Okay, it's splat. Pop goes the weasel. It's fine. Okay, I'm basing. Gain, thanks for the save, but listen, that's a lot. We got a lot from that. All right.
right, all right, we're looking good. Sell boots for another item. Lichbane, right, movement speed. All right, we're out carrying little Blanc. We're doing it. Dude, Storm Surge has popped off this game. I wish it told me how much item this dam this how much damage this item did alone. We're out carrying the LeBlanc somehow. I didn't think it was possible. Sets the uh the honorable mention here. Can we just do this? If our team doesn't want to LeBlanc's bottom, let's just do this. This is free. I'm gonna start it. Remember, this thing hits like a truck now though, so um we gotta not take too many hits from it. That's kinda scary. See how much da the Baron is so much tankier now and does so much damage. Like, sure, it's not tanky there, but I mean, it is tankier. Also, season 14 items just pack so much more of a punch. 1200 AP. 1200 AP this game. We're not even at 40 minutes for Gathering Storm. Just all the AP items give more AP. This is 100 up from 80. This is down 10, but this is 100, 120, right? 140, all of it buffed. Um, That's not good. We're dead. I see Mrs. LeBlanc. She can still one-shot me, so I got to respect it. I need my shrooms this game. I think I go bottom. I honestly, I would love to backdoor. With Lich Bean, I one-shot the Nexus. Oh, we're going for it. Oh, we're going for it. Oh, they're all top. Wait, we win this. This is, I mean, this Nexus is dead. I'm already here. GG. I'll even type it right now like a cocky bastard. They forgot. They left the trap door open. 1,500. Ready? Boom! Oh wow! How did we win? Don't, couldn't tell you. Couldn't tell you how you won. Let's check out the uh, the stats here. Banger, banger build, banger game. Obviously, just a classic game on the Rift. Who do I honor? Action. He's playing jungle willingly. New items galore. Check the damage here. Fifty-one k. Nice. <coughs> Press the attack to twenty-two hundred. Pressy attack does nothing late game, right? Because we made it to full items, but it's just to get that early game going. It's just to, to get that snowball going. I think it's really important. Yeah, the build, right? Nasher, Storm Surge. Once we had Storm Surge, we were surging all day. Shadow Flame, once we get snowballing, 120 AP versus Squishies. Can't argue that. Void Staff, Death Cap, GG's. Hey, you two. How the heck we doing? <laughs> so, as you can see, I typed here. We're versus Teemo in the top lane as Teemo 500 IQ. We are going to be rocking with what I think will be the best build in Season 14. And this game is going to show off why. So, on hit, Teemo got major buffs, right? Blade Rune King got buffed. Your first auto slows. Terminus got buffed. Well, Terminus is a new item. Sorry. Every other auto, you get either Armor and Amar or Hybrid Pen, and Rage Blade got buffed. It no longer is crit-based. So, On Hit Teemo is a flexible build in Season 14. There's so many items. This game is going to be a per perfect example. So, I think the core build is going to be the best one, which is Blade of the Rune King, Terminus 2nd, and you can flex your boots, right? Merc Treads, Steel Caps, or Berserkers. But the good thing about On Hit Teemo is it's flexible because no more Mythic items. So this game, I'm actually going to rush Wits End first item. Wits End first is going to be super clutch versus enemy Teemo, obviously. I'm going to build Magic Resist. So I'm going to go Merc Treads into Wits End, and I won't be blindable. So we're going to win with that build this game. It's going to be so much better than whatever he's building. I'm assuming AP. Uh, so on hit Teemo, going to be a power play. So again, the core build is Bork, Terminus, Rage Blade, but you can flex it, right? I'm going to go Wits End and then Terminus and then Rage Blade most likely. Or maybe Wits End and Bork. We'll see. I think Wits End Terminus will be best for this game. But again, the, the, the flexible is where it's at. You start Doran's Blade with this setup because Doran's Blade got giga buffed, right? Cole is kind of outdated since Doran's Ring and Doran's uh, Blade both got buffed. So we'll be starting the Doran's items from now on. It's really dumb not to. And then for my build, with this build, you want to be going Lethal Tempo in Season 14. Because Terminus, you need 10 autos to fully stack it. Uh, sorry, yeah, 10 autos to fully stack it. You need 5 stacks on the Armor and MR, and you need 5 stacks on the Hybrid Pen. So, press the attack. We're not looking for 3 autos. We're looking for 10. So, Lethal Tempo is going to be the play. A lot of talking. There's a lot of new items. A lot to explain. But, yeah, anyway. Look at this item. So if you look at it, 30 magic damage on hit, 80 attack speed, light and dark, 3 armor and MR, 6% hybrid pen per auto. So 1 auto, auto MR, 1 auto hybrid pen, kind of wild, right? Insane item. And also, Bork, again, first auto slows, rage blade, no more crit. And then the tanky items, look at a hole breaker. The situational part is where it gets crazy. This does damage every fifth auto, and you can split push. So just, again, on hit Teemo, super flexible, a lot of insane items. It's going to be wild. 
Um, we're getting pinged. I'm kind of down to roam. I'm on my way. We don't have our mid laner though. I'm on my way. I'm here. Nice. We got there right in the nick of time. I'm down to auto this out. I have lethal tempo, so I'm an early game beast. I'm blinded. I'm an early game blinded beast. That's fine. She gonna spear me or what? Oh, she is. Um, I'm dead. He has ignite. I'm dead. I'm dead. Okay, you know what? We let him. I. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Let's get wits in. Maybe I'll go. I'll go merc treads in wits in. Do I miss a wave? If I don't miss a wave, it's good. Oh my god! I just got team mode. I did kill the Belvusi though, but I got team mode on the on the return. Damn, that champ does some damage, huh? That champ does some damage. I miss a cannon, but I get everything else. That's fine. I'll allow it. We're going to outscale him with our build. He's going to go AP. I'm going to go Merc Treads and, and, and Wits and then we're going to be invulnerable. We got a little Pingy Peter on the graves. Little Pingy Peter. Oh, our bot lane's gonna have. If that doesn't go well, he's about to flame our bot lane. He's been pinging up a storm. Uh, it looks like he didn't die, so we got lucky there. But he's about to be Pingy Peter and in, in the, in the Pingy Bunch. Pingy Peter picked a pepper. They got LeBlanc roamed, or else his girls be pissed. But now LeBlanc misses a wave. I get an auto? Nice. That's fine. That's fine. Teemo versus Teemo, eh? Teemo versus the Teemo matchup. He definitely has me beat with the room page, right? The grass versus lethal tempo. He's got the early game, but I outscale it, right? I'm going to get wit's end, and I have the merc treads. He went giant spell first item. What the heck does that build into? All right, let's get this bad boy. Get that magic resist first. I'm not going to buy a pot, though. I'm going to rely on my lifesteal, I guess. Yeah, just the flexibility, man. Look at all these situational items. I like the three offensive items into tank. Any three offensive items you choose. So Wits End, Terminus Rage Blade, Pork Terminus Rage Blade, into tank. Because the tank items looking good this season. Jack Show looks wild as well. There's so much, so much possibility. I'm gonna shove this. Timo just went back to base. I'm gonna shove this and go help the, the graves. Or I can just get a plate, honestly. What if I just get a plate? That's probably better. I'm not gonna help the graves. I lied. Getting a plate is way better. It's gonna be freaking. What was it? 160 gold now? 125? I think it got nerfed. I think it's 125. One twenty five, okay. Did he really only do one? He did one and left. One little void nugget? Yeah, where's enemy Timo at? He's been taking a while. Is he going around the bend here? No, he just took his time. Okay. I can help him now, I suppose. I only have much to base for. Put a shroom down for all these little guys. Boom. I'm a genius. Tied it out a little bit. I'm helping a jungler. I'm a good little boy. So what these are, because this is new, right? All season 14 exclusive. What these are, they're the void nuggets. Each Every time you kill one, you do true damage to enemy turret. If you kill five, they spawn a little voidling similar to ZZ Rob Portal back in the day. And that's where they get max value. This lane's a bit of a snooze fest. Because, like, Teemo versus Teemo, we're not going to kill each other. We're just going to auto-blind and run away. And he that favors him right now. So we're chilling until we get wits. When we get wits in, we can start running him down. But until then, he's favored with that grasp. That grasp. But that's okay. 
We will outscale, we will outperform. I just can't fight him right now, and it's okay. I understand. Ooh, I, I win this, right? Lethal tempoing? It's, it's gonna be close. Ah, I see what's happening here. I, I late flashed. No, no more jumpy, no more jumpies, no more jumpies. Okay, we're good. Ooh, okay, I see what's happening. I see what's happening. The enemy team will try baiting me into the Belvusi. We had that 1v1 with the lethal tempo. All good. That's fine. Okay, I see what's happening here. Keep building that wit's end. All right, all right. I had that too. He's lucky. We're still up 20 CS. We're out, we're out teamoing the Teemo. Wit's end terminus, because I have bloodline for my life still and i have dorn's blade so yeah we don't need we don't need blade of the ring king this game really good but not not in this game but that's the beauty of this build again the flexibility i can't stop jizzing over it right which end then terminus and then i will be one which end terminus rage blades and defensive items i mean if i wanted to i could even go hole breaker second if i if i feel like i'm gonna be splitting a lot this game which i could do it's it's a possibility but i think i'll 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 stick to hole breaker third third if anything yes, I'd like to keep getting played sir but I guess he could blind me oh that turret shot hurt okay I'll take my base I'll leave I'll put another shroom down on lickety split I'm out okay bear back the Teemo versus Teemo matchup. Not the most exciting, I will admit. But I'm sure people want to see it anyway. Teemo versus Teemo. What the heck is he building? Is he built like, what is, is he building Rift Me? What is he building? Crystalline Blazer, Bracer, Giant's Belt. What is that build into? Is he, oh, he's going hard still, isn't he? This little fucker's going hard still. He's going tank mode, hard still grasp. Wow, maybe I will go uh, Blade of the Ring King second then. He's going hard still. I make some tanky. Yeah, I'll go Bork second. Keep farming that gold for it. Yeah, I'll go Bork second. If, he, if he's going hard still, it actually works out really well. Then I can 1v1. I get a plate here too. Yeah, we, we are outmatching him with the gold at least. We're doing well. Because I'm up 20 CS and I'm going to get another plate gold. That's huge. Get my stealth off really quick. Hit every shroom known to man. That's okay, though. Look at the true damage. Boom. 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 What up? Boom. What up? What's at 900? So I need one more plate or I need a wave. Okay, yeah, we'll get the wave. 900, then I base. Then we come back and kick his ass with the item advantage. I have to get a clean engage with stealth, right? I don't care if I eat this damage here. I need one more CS's. <laughs> little rat. <laughs> that little rat. Okay, I'm. I'm. I gotta get my base and I get wits end. Base wits end. Base wits end. Graze is fighting Belvus. Yeah, I'm not gonna fight that though, pal. Listen, buddy. I can't fight that. I have one HP. This guy's about to freaking type up a storm. You can tell he's about to let a paragraph go. He got 1v1, but he's about to let a paragraph rip. Look at him go. I'm not gonna type though, there's no point. We go top lane. He's about to let it rip. He's about to rip it and ship it. I guess I'm down to go auto attack Velvet. She was kind of low. See if she if I get there before she finishes up the void nuggets. She's doing them. I'm here. Papa's here. Ooh. Yeah, there it is. And I get the void nugget for myself. Huge. We only have four, though. Ah, we don't... We can't spawn. I should have won Super Lens, by the way. So you spawn the void nuggets at five, but we're only at four. But it does amp up a little more true damage. I get another plate too. He's coming back with a heart still. 
Um, he's going back a heart still, but I think it's totally fine. I really would like this plate. I think it's asking a lot. I really want to. Oh, the plate, it just expired. Okay, that's fine. Okay, this is fine. I'm going to leave. Go back, sir. I'm going to get a sweeper as well. So for me to kill him, I had to stealth and open on him with wit's end and get my lethal tempo stacking. I will go Bork second. Since he has heart still, I think that makes um that makes Bork a whole lot better, right? Because Bork's good versus health. We could one v one him. If he if he lets me actually fight him, we could one v one him for sure. I'm going to assume he's going to push. I'm going to open on him here. I should be able to kill him if he goes to this tower. He's been playing like a little rat, though. We're up to, I mean, we've got to leave. We're up 10 CS and we're up two plates, right? Two plates, 10 CS, and we got to kill him, Bell So it's like, we're up a lot. Ooh. I keep walking forward. You're going the wrong way. Where are you going, Timo? Yes, sir. Maybe Bell Blissey's doing Herald. I think him and Belbos is on Herald. That's okay. If we get some kills bottling, it's totally fine. Nice, we do. That's huge. The home Belbos on Herald. That's okay. I just have to. Oh, he's here. Well, Belbos is bottom. Cool. So we can just fight him. I I win the uh, the elongated battles. So that's what that's what we're looking for right there. Getting a lot of autos in. Super winnable game. Even with the Graves drama, super winnable. Dude, this tower. Be careful, Mr. Teemo. I'm, I'm doing the true damage to it. We're looking good. I can eat, I can eat a, a little trade like that. That's fine. I think I'm just going to keep smacking this tower around. They're all on the map. Yeah, I'm going to smack this tower up. I have double I have double lifesteal from the Vamp Scepter and the Doran's Blade. He's running Oom. Um. This is our window. We get this tower and we assert our dominance. He just bought in a minion, right? Am I seeing that right? That's fine. I win the long battles. He can get a hard still procs all he wants. We're about to take his freaking turret. You can proc well hard still, but I'm about to take your turret. Oh, baby, that's a top cap. Got the turret, baby. Up 20 CS, and turret. Beautiful. First turret. Oh, not first turret of the game, but still. Still good stuff. All right, the better Teemo has one lane. Now we have to get our Bork and just, like, cheese him. Once we get Bork, we can actually kill him in a, in a fair amount of time, so. Okay, we're looking good. Game's not looking that good, but we'll be okay. Bork, Terminus. Then Rage Blade. Yeah, I think Rage Blade's last. I think Bork than Terminus. Because we need the Terminus to be tanky. Once we get Terminus, we actually want one uh, one we want everybody. I'm down to fight. I'm down to get into an, a fight here. I'm I'm pretty strong at the moment. Not not first Belveth, but first literally everybody else. I'm putting a blind Belveth, so I think it's totally fine. Maybe I go for Teemo instead of helping Graves and Herald, actually. I'm gonna go kill Teemo. <clears throat> Since he's he's out a little bit, I can run him down. Oh yeah, he is red buff though. He took his freaking jungler's red buff like the little rat that he is. I'm igniting him so um, he can't like actually run. Um, I lose this. Um, I lost that one v one. How? He has a heart still. How did I lose the one v one? He said, silly manko. Oh, I took 500 minion damage. Nice. I took 500 damage from minions. Nobody told me that. And I took 200 from red buff. Um, okay, it's fine. It's winnable. It's winnable. It's winnable. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's winnable. It's fine. It's fine. Winter Warlock got the better of me there. That's fine. I got this. Don't worry. Top lane still in shambles, and it's still a free game, right? It's still a freebie. It's, it's fine. It's fine. Once I get Bork, he's done for. 
What is this item? Haunting guys. Oh, so he's going to Leandre's. Once I get Bork, he's done for trust. Dude, red buff actually did 200 damage. It's wicked. Freaking team over is Teemo. Bro, that heart still is doinking me. That heart still prog is getting a little thick. I'm not going to lie. What the heck is that? He's only gained 119 health, though. All right, once I get Bork, I'm going to kick his ass. Trust. I've seen 100 gold here. That's what I'm looking for. Just looking for that 100 gold. Ah, I see what's happening here. It's the second time, Ms. Belbo. See? I'll just leave. That's fine. All good. I'm out. I'll get my, uh, I believe the Rune King. Wait, why do I have the, wait, I have the Herald Recall, because why again? Why do I have the Herald Recall? Because does Graves have Herald? Graves doesn't have Herald. It's because we slayed Herald recently? Huh. We can, we can do this. We can fight this. This is really good. This is really good. This is free. Graves should be up here, right? There it is, baby. There's that Bleed of the Rune King. That Bork damage versus the Heart Steel. There it is. We're back. We're so freaking back. Good job from LeBlanc. Graze is here, but a day late and a dollar short, eh? Really good job from LeBlanc. And and that Bork damage, right? The first auto does the... The first auto um, slows them, right? So, pretty sick. Um, we can actually get this whole turret here. Because we have the four stack of the Voidlings. It does true damage, right? We do true damage. 600 gold in our pocket, then we get ready for Drake. Huge. That's actually so massive. That just broke the game open, didn't it? Very nice. Okay, Terminus, third item, for sure. Because we want that tankiness still. So th when it, when you get to, like, the third and fourth item in this build, it gets, like, difficult to judge the situation. Pretty much, like, Blade of the Rune King is mandatory for 1v1ing. Gives everything you want for 1v1, especially versus tanks. Wits End versus AP champs if you need to survive, right? And then Terminus is mandatory in this build because it's freaking broken. Look at the stats it gives. Rage Blade is mandatory late game to keep your damage high. And then after that, everything's optional, right? So Hope Breaker is good if you're splitting. Every five, this change every five autos. It does extra damage now, but it still gives you all the goodies. <clears throat> and then um, Abyssal Mask is good versus AP champs. And then uh, Kinnick, Kinnick Rukin, right, is good versus AP champs. Jack Show is good versus everybody. Randu is good versus AD champs. But you see a lot of the um, a lot of situational stuff. This is free. I'm in. We're in. I'm I'm pretty one v nine right here. Okay, Timo's top, but we get Drake. I'm kind of down to keep staying here and getting mid turret maybe. Oh, we're oh, that's okay. I'm autoing. We're autoing. Just one shot. I'm down to just maybe try and get mid turret. Timo's pushing top, but we get Drake right. I can get I can get top lane whenever, or LeBlanc can get it too. Actually, I kind of want to get mid turret here. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna let top push. I want, really want to get mid with this empowered, the the void nuggets. We can kill this. It's it's important to break up in mid when you can. Oh, our team's scared. Our team is very scared. You can tell. Hmm. Graze did Drake and is pushing bottom, so I think we have to uh, cancel. Cancel that mid turret. All good. Graves is kind of throwing a fit this game, but our team's doing the best they can to try and overcome it. Got respect. I think it's still winnable too, by the way. If they overstep, I'm down. Can we get an in? Am I alive? Do I just walk it out? I'm not alive. I don't walk it out. Took a lot of damage. Our Graves... Our Graves is low-key hostaging us. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I could sell my Doran's Blade for Terminus. Is that worth it? It is, because I have the Bork lifesteal now. I'm at three items. The Seraphine melted me pretty freaking hard. Timo also sat on me for 1,600. 
I, I was, I didn't, I th I thought we could hang in there a little longer. All good. All good. We're gaming. All good. We got three items. Um, I think I might split this game. It might be a split push game, guys. Because, like, right now, I can go Rage Blade for more damage, which I don't think I need. I can go Hole Breaker and split and try and win the game, because I think it's Hole Breaker. Because I go Hole Breaker, and I sit in this island, and I split push, and I win that way. Or I can go Rage Blade or Jack Show and team fight. Jack Show is actually pretty good. Armor, MR, health. Like, what more can you want? I think hole breaker and splitting is a play though. Like this game, we're not really winning team fights. I don't think we'll win team fights either. Like, are we really gonna win team fights with our graves never grouping? Probably not. So I think splitting might be Ooh, this looks like we should we should do this. Our LeBlanc's flanking. Damn, we missed everything. That's unfortunate. Yeah, I don't think we I'm I'm not I'm gonna be honest, I think we go hole breaker and we perma split. The perma split kind of game. I'm actually going to go bottom now. If they take a uh, Baron, that's fine. We're never going to be able to fight that. There's no shot. So I'm going to start pushing bottom. Yeah, this is a Holebreaker game for sure. We're not winning these team fights. But I think when I go Holebreaker, we could definitely win the side lane. I won't be one that enemy Teemo as long as I get a good jump on him. He went Riftmaker too. It's pretty pretty bad. Okay, Teemo's here, but our team's already dead mid. I'm on my way. They're kind of low. Can LeBlanc come? Does she have TP? She doesn't. We had numbers. Their team was bottom. But it, it, it can't just be me. I'll see what I can do. Hey, there it is. I'm him. I'm him, baby. That's that on hit. Just shredding him. Oh, ouchies, ouchies, ouchies. Chill, chill, chill. Ma'am? Okay, I'm going to see what I can do here. We're cooking. Okay, that's all I got for now. Bro, I'm... Am I... Am I... Okay, we're good. Am I the only one doing anything? Am I... I'm legit the only one doing anything. I don't think my team did anything there. Hello? I killed two of them, and I put Seraphine one shot, and they were all dead. Yeah, we're not team fighting. It's whole breaker and split. I... My team didn't... They just ran into Seraphine and got pooped on. This Seraphine's crapping on us. The Seraphine's absolutely dumpstering us. I'm not going to lie. But I think it's more of my team being stinky. I don't think LeBlanc's hit anything this game. I'll be honest. We're up 20 CS. 7, 4, and 1. I've got 8 KP out of 13. More of a, I think it's more of a team diff than anything. Timo's sitting at 5 KP out of 21. Hey, Lux, I'm going bottom. Ma'am, you're a support. Ma'am, you're the support. There it is. Atta girl. Support of 56 CS. Hmm. Yeah, I see what kind of support she is. Our Grace has 3 KP out of 13. They're not even attempting to do Baron. That's interesting, but it's valid because Baron's so much stronger now. It's wild. If my team can stop them from doing Baron one time and give me some room to work, I think it's winnable. I can't really roll Teemo right now. I can with Holebreaker. I could beat him right now if it's 1v1, but... They might just elect to come over here for Drake. They might elect to kill my team. Pretty sure I win this 1v1. There's no way. There's no freaking way, man. There's no freaking way. This guy's a beast, I'll say it. This guy's a beast, I'll say it. He's a beast. I'll give it to him, this guy's a beast. Guys, this team is a freaking beast, I'll say it. Once I get a whole break, I'll kill him, though, easily. I'm going back bottom. It's still winnable, believe it or not. It's still winnable. <coughs> I've had some adversity this game. I mean, we have three drakes. It's actually a super winnable. Don't we win at four drakes? Once I get a whole breaker and four drakes, don't we win? It's a cash out. It's a win out.
Graves is scaling. Graves has been farming the whole game, which has been which has been effing us, but at least he's been scaling, I'm just saying. Timo's top, we get bot turret. Oh, it's free. Macro diff, we get bot turret here. 600 gold in my pocket. That's my hole breaker money. I have my void touch too. Oh, it's winnable. If they want to go do Baron, I can almost yeah, Timo's gonna come bottom, so I can just keep I can just stay down here. I don't think they're actually gonna get Baron, but I mean I get hole breaker off this, so it's huge. Timo's gonna base and hold me, which is fine for now. My team should be able to get Baron for free from that. Oh wait, are uh, yeah, guys, Baron is really strong these days. RDC's not there. RDC's trolling a bit, I won't lie. Our Graze is about to type an essay off of, off of that. I feel bad. But that this one's a fair essay, because wh where's our ADC at? We're doing Baron. Okay, now I won't be one enemy Teemo. Trust. I know I said it earlier and I got smacked, but now I won't be one him. Um, I'm going back bottom. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. What's my last item here? What is my last item? Oh, look at the scuttle crab. Is it just rage blade to get my damage back? I feel like I need more tankiness, but it could just be rage blade. I mean, I can't want me want me to a seraphine Yumi. She's freaking seven three and seven. I'm gonna try though. I'll be honest. I'm gonna try. I don't think it will work out. Maybe it will. I'm down to just push, honestly. If I can have their Seraphine Yumi bot lane and not killing my team, that looks pretty good for us. All right, if Seraphine Yumi jump on me and and I can dodge her R, we're looking good. I'm I'm hard pushing. Shut down. Uh, okay. Looks like we might lose. I'll still vote no. I mean, I get inhib here. If they don't end, I get inhib. The new, it's now three to two on quick plays. So that vote, if they get three, not looking good. Wait, I'm, wait we could base phrase. I'm just going to say I end to make sure they don't FF or try to convince them not to FF. Timo's going to base and hold me, but I get in him and I can base. There's no way they end in 10 seconds. I don't believe that. I'm actually going to... Do I stay or do I base? I'll base. I'll base. If he fights me, I'll stay. I'm pretty sure I win this. I have hole breaker now. Don't I win this? Okay, that's huge, and I live, and I end the game, and I end the game. Go big or go home, baby. Cannon, you got me. I have freaking literally one HP. I have no wave. Are any of them basing for me, guys? Does anyone know? Where's our team at? All right, I think their team's basing for me. Can we do Baron? Oh, their team's not basing. Do I end the game here? I end the game. Nidalee, don't base. Somebody get Nidalee. Somebody get Nidalee. Go stop her port. Guys, Nidalee's basing. Oh, she's not. She's just walking around. Yumi, don't kill me, please, ma'am. Fucking Yumi flashes on me. Is that serious? The cast of I'm dying to the minions. All right, that's fine. Okay, listen. Yumi Flash ulted me. Okay, Yumi Flash ulted me, and Nidalee was there anyway. I was gonna be dead, but I almost ended the game solo. It's winnable. I think I go Abyssal Mass. I just need more AP. I don't think I need more damage. I don't think Rage Lord's gonna help me. We just go Abyssal. I'm pretty sure. I, actually, I could go the Renook item too. A magic 600 magic health shield or Abyssal. Rizzu's enemy nearby magic resist by 5 and I gain MR. 300 health, 60 MR, 10 haste. The haste is worthless. I think it's uh, Rukorn because we've just been duking it out. So I get a shield and I pull up to fight the enemy Teemo. I'm down. I think it's Rukorn. Because like we're, it's been just like boom, 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 1v1 me, bro. 80. I don't think I need the haste. Yeah, I think it's Rukorn. Huge. Though I see, look, listen. This game has been up and down. But now we're stomping him, and the and the split push is unreal. The amount of damage is unreal. Everything's unreal about this. Leandri is interesting. So hard steel riftmaker Leandri's. He's getting forty six AP from the riftmaker. That's pretty pretty big value. I just think we have to not die, guys. I think it's a not die angle. I'm sure I'll hit a, a shroom or two. 
I don't need the wave because we open up like their whole damn. We open up all the gates here. Nice ward. I'm just gonna go though. Their team will have to base. This team can't one v one me. Uh, I'm pretty sure their team's here. I'm gonna just kill him. Just kill him. He can't. He can't hold me. He can't hold me. Nidalee's basing. Let's go, baby. Teemo Diff. Let's go. Stop it. I'm him. I'm him, baby. That's me. That's why I'm the Teemo guy. Right there. Do you see the build? You can't one me one me. I'm him. Boom. Beautiful. See? I'll eventually... Oh, sorry. That's a Chevy cam. Chevy, I, I got Chevy excited. He's like, dude, what are you yelling at, dude? Why are you yelling? Sorry, I had the Chevy cam there. You don't want to see my bed, though. There it is. I prevail. Beautiful. 35, 36K damage. Teemo, their Teemo did 28K, 36K. But you saw that 1v1 potential at the end? That 1v1 potential was massive, right? GG's. Look at that. That that bill again. The beauty, beauty about this bill is how situational it is. GG's. We are playing tank team of this game. As you can see, I'm in the mid lane here versus Zed. Mid lane's looking a little bit different, a little more wide open. I think team will be better in the mid lane. We're rocking tank mode. So the room page, old trusty grass conditioning overgrowth, presence of mind, alacrity for the mana for the attack speed. Now tank mode in season 14 is gonna be a whole lot better. So of course we gotta go hard still. You always gotta go hard still and get it stacking for tank mode. But now for Rift Maker. They added this demonic embrace passive to Rift Maker. So we'll be going Heart Still, we'll be going Rift Maker, and then we'll of course um be going uh that 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 where is it? Where is it? Titanic Hydra. Where is it? There we go, Titanic Hydra. So Heart Steel, Titanic Hydra, Rift Maker. That's gonna give me the bonus AD, that's gonna be the bonus AP, right? And it's going to give me all that health. After that, we can kind of go whatever we want. That's just the basis of it. Because Demonic Embrace got, you know, removed. So we go Rift Maker. Because it's pretty much Demonic Embrace and Rift Maker in one. Kind of OP if you're a AP Bruiser. Not OP for AP Teemo. But for Tank Teemo, booyah. We can go Warmogs after. We can go any tank item, literally. We'll probably go Warmogs to keep it nice and simple and easy. We're gonna focus on getting our grass stacks. We're gonna get the heart steel stacks. We're gonna be gaming. Mid lane Teemo is a little bit better now since it's more wide open. I think that's that's way better for Teemo. Those mages can't just one shot you anymore if you have all this wiggle room to work with. Zed's not an easy lane, but not terrible. Brother versus Zed than a Syndra, right? Also, for our starting item, you, we are no longer starting Cole. Cole got all the Doran's items got buffed, so Cole no longer is viable, right? Because Doran's Ring, Doran's Blade, and Doran's Shield all got buffed recently. That makes Cole weaker just by, by nature of competition. I went Doran's Shield since that is not an easy lane. I'm looking for that scaling anyway. We have Arthur Lanches. Arthur Lanches is a Brazilian team. I mean, he hopped in this game. He's playing Ash Top. <laughs> That's a little little uh, celebrity spotted. That dude's a beast. Challenger Brazilian team. I mean, and a good friend of mine. Kane's on the top side, huh? Zed's looking at me the wrong way. I don't like this. I'm going to pop my pot and stay, though. I'm going to stick around for a while. I don't think he actually has a sack to kill me. It's a nice chunk, though. And it is a good chunk for him. That'll do something. We can play for top scuttle. We can just sit here and not die to Kane. I think I... I don't know if I'll be able to flash. I don't have that much damage. Flash auto ignite. Would that kill him? I'll try. I'll go for it. I think it does. I got the Q off, too. Nice, huge. This has, I'm not even gonna use my, okay, I'll use my Demolish Proc. It has that, uh, the uh, reinforcing, right? Before five minutes, all of it's reinforced, so it doesn't do any damage, but I was thinking to myself, like, I'm not gonna be back for another minute anyway, I'm about to base, so. It's not a waste, it is not a waste. Hey Kane, how you doing? I'm out. Sorry, Elise, I gotta go. Can't help you with Scut Scut. All right, Heart Steel. Heart Steel, Rift Maker, Titanic Hydra, Warmogs. That's our setup. 
<clears throat> I'm gonna go hard sell before anything else. I'm not even gonna buy it. I'll buy regular boots. I'm not gonna buy boots too though. Probably go tanky, tanky mythic. Could go berserkers, but I'm gonna prefer the tanky mythic here. Oh, Arthur Lance just got killed by the Teemo. Warmogs actually sounds good now because Riftmaker doesn't give you the Omnivamp unless you're in combat. So now you got to get that healing from out of combat. Kind of makes sense. Maybe Tankbo did get upgraded with the uh, the new, new Riftmaker where it pretty much combined with Demonic. An enemy has been slain. He's going to plan with the combo. Can I get an auto Q for it? I'm down to eat those combos as long as I get the, the full auto Q value. Jeez, we're hard diving their bot lane. Like, what the heck? We're at tier two turret. I guess I'm kind of down to go down there. It's gonna be crazy, but <clears throat> I don't think I should stay. I'll be honest. I'm kind of down though. This seems like a terrible idea. <laughs> uh, I'm here. I should be able to get this kill, right? It's close. Oh, nice. Good flash, actually. All right. We saved it. We managed to get a kill off that and save Elise. Got a kill, saved Elise, and I don't even miss my wave as long as I don't die. Maybe Zed will go for Elise and not me. Yeah, she's dead to Zed for sure. I don't miss my mid wave, actually, so it's fine. There's Zed behind her. Well, we did save her, but then she stayed for the freaking Krugs. I don't miss my Siesta, so actually it's kind of worth it. We saved her and she still freaking stayed for 40 minutes. She didn't give a damn. Freaking jungle mains, man. Can Zed just punk me with an with a pressing R or what? We're gonna find out. This is where it gets tricky, right? Cause Zed pokes you, you can't do anything about it. And he presses R, but I think we're okay. I'll just take my base. Because I take my base and get more HP. That's fine. 10 grass facts. I would like some more, but we'll, we'll work with that. It's fine. It's workable. <clears throat> Where is it a hard steal? Crystalline Bracer. Nice. Actually, this item's juice for lane, right? That health region. Health region equals good for lane. Very nice. Yeah, so with this build, pretty much it's just free stats galore, right? Hard steal gives you free HP. Riftmaker now, since the change, it gives you all that. Then it gives you free AP with your bonus health. And Titanic Hydra, right? Gives you free AD with your bonus health. Wait, Titanic Hydra doesn't give the AD anymore. Hold up. Time out. Uh oh. We get oh, does that hit? Nice try. Wait, Titanic Hydra doesn't give you free AD anymore. I was lied to. We got the we got the grass proc. Hold up, we got a pivot. Hold up. This isn't giving you free AD. Um, yeah, we got a hard pivot. Hold up. I was lied to. Did they move it to a similar item? Um, now what? We gotta find something else built. Okay, we'll still go Riftmaker second. And it's still pretty season 14 fortinified, right? Still pretty cool. I'd like to get the demolish proc. I don't want to die, though. I'm very scared of the Zed, I'll be honest. We're going to have to wait for the demolish proc. That's a good poke, actually. That will keep him at bay. I need to go. Yeah, we, I don't want to get, I don't want to give up the void krugs. I got to skip this plat, this tower plate. These void krugs are insanely good. So he already got one of them, right? He already got one. That's fine. He should die. Nice. I got this. Huge. Nice. He got one of the void nuggets. We're going to get the other two, so it's fine. <laughs> as long as I don't die to Mr. Zed. These void nuggets, they do damage, true damage to the enemy turret. And if you get five, which is two spawns, you spawn like a uh, void similar to the drop portal. Which is insanely broken. It melts them. Yeah, so Kane got one, we got two. So if we can get the next spawn and get all three of them, we still spawn that that uh that ZZ Rot portal void. I should mm, I'm gonna stay. I have full HP. Maybe we get a plate, maybe we don't. I'll get a plate. I get a plate, right? We can greed for this. I don't get the plate. I need to I need to go again. We have heart still on base, okay. 
or at least is a maniac. I'm gonna stay mid for now. I, I have to. I have to get this plate. I'm not willing to lose another 125 gold for free. An ally has been slain. I'm not losing another 125. No way. See that little? That's a true damage. That little glow up effect. Nice. I got another grass proc too. Okay, I'm gonna get my heart still now. You're right back. All right, what do I build instead of Titanic? Health and health regen. Holebreaker. Ooh, it could be Holebreaker actually. Because Holebreaker now, Holebreaker changed every five autos. You do more damage, which suits Teemo a bit more. So it could be Holebreaker. <coughs> it probably is Holebreaker, I'll be honest. Could be Jack Show since you could build that now. Just a generic tank item, health, armor, and after five seconds of combat, you get more health, armor. I mean, armor and MR. That's pretty good. Could be Abyssal. Could be Anathemas if one of them get really fed. All right, so yeah. So we'll we'll decide what we want to do. We can go. Um, we're gonna go. We're gonna go Rift Maker War Mogs. Ooh, that connects. Do I have the damage? Oh, what an arrow! What an arrow! Dude, what an ash shower from Arthur Lanches in the top lane. That was sick. And I got the hardstone proc. And I get a turret plate. How beautiful was that? What a shot. What a shot. Absolutely beautiful. And I get another Graspy. Huge. That's that's nice. I mean, I don't think I get another plate, do I? I'm gonna go armor. They're pretty much full ED except Teemo. Who cares about the Teemo? I'm just pokey him, right? I want a heart seal proc. Nice, we got it. That's fine. I don't think I die here. Um, I don't die, right? I'm dead, guys. I killed Kane. It's fine. I got Kane. I got Kane. <laughs> two for one? We got the two for one. We'll take it. I got Kane, we'll take it. We're definitely going steel caps. They're literally full ED except Teemo. And then we're gonna get the Riftmaker next. Okay. The Riftmaker's coming next. Look at this haunting guys. Wow. That's a powerful item. Riftmaker, Warmogs, Holebreaker. Riftmaker uh, Holebreaker if we need to split. Anathemas if we don't, maybe. Riftmaker, Warmogs into whatever whatever else. <laughs> I'll go top here, that's fine. Malignants. Malignant. I just want those tower plates, baby. That's what I'm looking for. Can I kill this guy with hard steel? Does he beat me? Uh, we'll see. I just want to get the turret, right? We want to get those those platy poos. That's where the gold's at. That's all I'm thinking about. Frickin' Teemo. Bro, he has a minefield up here. He had freaking 20 shrooms laid down. He had the minefield. I wasn't ready for it. I got to take a base. I got to get freaking sweeper lens. Uh, I don't think our Elise is playing for the uh, the void nuggets. He has been sitting up those, mi those shrooms for a while, huh? If I get, if I walk, right, do I have time to get a plate? Maybe. Be bases, I might have time. That looks fine. That looks like three kills. Nice. I would think Kane's taking the void nuggets. Wait, if he if he's basing, I actually have time to get a plate. I think at least one. Clear these shrooms so my my wave doesn't hit it. Nice. I'm all about the Benjamins here. Nice. We, we get we get a plate. We might even get two, actually. It's so big. I don't blame him for basing. I would have, too. Okay, we, we get at least one. I think we'll get two, though, because I have that Demolish Brock. Beautiful. Show me the money. Yeah, he's going to defend that one. I'm going to get this one. Screw it. I don't care if I die. Hundred twenty five gold is hundred twenty five gold, I'm just saying. An extra one twenty five? I'm gonna have to hit that worth. I'm gonna have to hit that worth it. One twenty five gold? Hey, one twenty five gold, one twenty five gold. We ain't gotta kill mid, nice. Kites it. 
she dodges the hook? Freaking Malignant, you little shroomer. I'll go bottom. I'll go bot slash mid. I'll give top lane back to the ash. Riftmaker Warmogs. Hole breaker if I'm splitting, if I'm not splitting, any generic tank item. This is the like the new Sunfire, which is pretty cool. This like, actually looks interesting. Every second while in combat with champions, deal magic damage nearby, healing for it. That could be good. 400 HP as well. I think hope uh hope breaker or this item. Sustain damage is good with tank. I'm kinda down to look for a little action here. I, I wanna keep getting my heart still procs. Let's go run at Zed. Zed's five and five. Oh, it's five and five. Yeah, he's got the heart still proc. I'm pretty tanky, young man. Yeah, you can't one shot me anymore, brother. I've got my HP, I've got 3k HP. I'm not one shotable. We got him on a shroom. Those shrooms are deadly. That slow is wild. Heart still, please? He can't kill me, right? Is King gonna be here? I like that heart still proc. I kind of want to get the turret if I can. Ash is arrowing. Let's see it. Oh, it connects. Huge. Dude, Arthur launches on this Ash. He's insane. What? I really want to get this turret. It has one HP. Zed doesn't have ult up again, right? He just used it. All right, Pike's getting fancy with it. Nice. Got my heart so proc. Uh, I think I'm not going to go that way. <clears throat> I'm out. I'm going to go bottom. Or maybe I just stick around for Zed and Blitz. Did he see me? He has ult up, right? Why is he so fast? That doesn't have movement speed. Riftmaker, do I have my gold? I do. Nice. We can go mess with Kane, but I'm pretty sure he kills my ass. Blitz got the shutdown. That's fine. Blitz getting shut down is okay. I get my Riftmaker. Nice. He doesn't have any shadow. I'm going to let that expire, then flash on him. Oh, I'm fucking dead. I get a heart still proc, at least. I get a heart still proc, don't I? Run, Kane, run! I right, run, Pike. Jump, do the jumpy. That's fine. I can't believe, I can't believe Pike dies too. Okay, not worth it. I'll be honest. Not worth it. I forgot Kane was there. <coughs> but we're still looking good. 200 health from heart still. I'm a rift maker now. Look at that. 39 AP. 39 extra AP because of the health I have. 119 for a mythic item? Kind of nuts. And when we get that fully stacked, that Omnivance would be nice. I don't think tank mode is going to be the OP build, but honestly, with this Rift Maker, it's kind of looking pretty decent. Because Rift Maker got nerfed for AP Teemo, right? So for AP, AP Teemo, Rift Maker is nerfed because you don't get the Omnivamp until you're in combat for three seconds. But the thing is, this tank mode, you're going to be in combat for more than three seconds. You're going to have that Omnivamp going for a while, so. I'm down for Drake. I'm also down to run at them. I'm incredibly strong right now. I'm down just to fight because I want to get the hard steel props. I'm down to just run at them. As long as I don't get one tap, we're going to be looking good. Freaking shroom. <laughs> God damn it, Tima. Hook him. Hook him, Pike. Ah. Uh, oh, shit. I think we found them. They going to come back for us? <laughs> this little freaking Teemo, man. Hmm. We're doing Drake, but they're still around here. Their Teemo is 5 and 1. Look at Samira. I'm going to kill her. Oh, I got this. This is free. I'm going to lead with blind. Nice. That's a freebie. I take those. A little hard still proc, too. Got that Omni Vamp working. I'm down. I walked into that. 
are so proc. I'm not gonna lie, I think I'm gonna be dead. Ooh. Do we all die? I think we're all dead, aren't we? Kane's one shot. Do we have Pykel? Nice, big, big old. On the he hooked him onto the shroom too. Uh oh, does Pike clean? Pike cleans up. <coughs> nice. This Pike's gonna clean. Is that Dave Mon? Okay, we get that. I think. Yeah, I don't think we need another crystalline bracer. Boom, boom. Do we sell Doran Shield? One ten HP is pretty good. We'll need the item slot eventually, but I don't think. Yeah, let's sell it. I think I think I think we need the item slot. Also, I think this is insanely good. The movement speed. Okay, we're looking good. I mean, we're getting there. We're at 4k HP, right? Everything's working. Our Riftmaker is already giving obscene amounts of AP. 126 at the moment, right? And of course, the Omni Vamp is nice. I can't one be 9 I've been running at him like I own the place, but we're, we're pretty damn close. I think this unending despair is going to be good because it's more damage and more healing. I can easily kill these two. If Kane comes, I can't kill Kane, but I'm down to, to work on these two here. Oh, close. Nice try. I can easily kill Samira as long as Kane doesn't come. I need that. It's fine. I literally just ate a full Samira combo. No, I'm trolling. Oh, I, I'm stupid. I just had to not walk directly into him. I didn't even get my heart still proc. I walked directly into the cane. I'm an idiot. It's fine. I didn't have to die there. I got a little too crazy. But I ate that full smear combo. That felt good. Oh, nice. Thanks for the assist. Un and this item looks nutty, doesn't it? 400 health, armor, haste. Every seven seconds, you do 114 damage, healing for 250%. So healing for 300. Every seven seconds. Seven seconds is a long time, don't get me wrong. But I think that's exactly what I need this game. Because they're full AD, right? <clears throat> so we need an armor item. I don't think it's Randuin's. Kane doesn't have any crit. I don't think it's Holebreaker either, because I don't think I'm splitting this game. It's been kind of a uh, a, a freaking dogfight. I need to just get 200 gold. So how do I get that really quick at the base again? My heart still pumped 340. 341 HP is a magnificent for heart steel. Yeah, I mean, this unending despair is the perfect item for this game. Armor, more damage, more healing. Because I need I need armor. Jack Show could be good too, but the MR is kind of wasted, right? Well, not really. I guess because Timo's got a hint for a truck. So it's either unending despair or Jack Show. I just have to think to myself, do, do I think I'll be able to live for 14 seconds? Because like one proc is cool, but we probably want to get two out of unending despair. So I, will I be living for 14 seconds of fight is what I have to ask myself. I'm down to just take this turn in front of her. Oh, uh, we all died. I think that might be Baron gone. You're not doing Baron yet. That's good. Take a hard so proc. Maybe we'll get this turret next wave. We'll get it next wave. They can get a minute mid him, but that's fine. I wonder if Kane's coming down here or not. She can't kill me. I don't think she has the, the juice. Even if I dive turret, she doesn't have the juice apparently, so that's cool. Is Kane coming? <coughs> Where's Kane at? I might die to Kane, but I'm gonna stay for this turret. I'm gonna stay here. This turret's 600 gold. Even if I die, this is 600 gold still with the turret. They might just be doing Baron. He's not doing Baron, but I got the turret, so it's fine. Wow, they didn't get Baron, and I got the turret? That's actually really good for us. That's... Oh. <laughs> yeah, I'm out. <laughs> hey, I dodged that hook. Bro, I was gone. I dodged the hook and everything, and our team right in there. <laughs> kind of funny, I'm not going to lie, but... Jesus. I, I was out. I dodged the hook, guys. I was gone. I didn't need the help. I'm gonna go. Um, I'm gonna go Jack Show. I think I think this is gonna be a little bit better at the moment, because like the Ren the Renook is cool, but I think the armor Jack Show is gonna give me a lot more armor, because I'm getting increasing my bonus armor by 30 percent, armor and armor by 30 percent. So it's like that's a lot. That's a lot. A lot. I think I'll need that.
Should I stealth or just run at him? I think I'll wait. I think he's gonna push another wave. If I was him, I'd push another wave. It gives me time for my heart still to stack. Okay, I think he knows I'm here, but it's fine. Ah, I see what's happening. I don't think I I don't think I can live this. Bro, the cane was just waiting there. If we get bolt, that's worth it. We got Kanar, that's huge. Okay. We didn't get Zed. We got we got Kane. He was just waiting there. <coughs> like a little rat. Yeah, this is gonna. I need. I need to. I, I don't think that cane. I don't think I'm gonna live 14 seconds. It's kind of melting me. Look at this rift maker value. Freaking 160 AP, pretty much from this item, right? 80 plus 60, 140. 140 AP for one item is nuts. Once I get Jack Show, we're looking real good. 15 Hundo. The cane's melting me. Like I have no HP at all. Like what the heck is cane? What the heck is cane? All AP plus crank, what a beast. The Jack Show is really good then. I need the resistances. After 20 minutes, oh, Timo took our red. Little freaking rat. I think I want to leave it up to my team to hold Timo. I don't think I want to split him. I don't have much magic resist. How do we win this? I have to kill Kane and Zed without dying. <clears throat> I swept this, so they shouldn't know I'm here. Unless they're hackers. Elise is top. Elise is farming top. We're chilling. <coughs> Blitz should come over here for a pick. There we go. That's what we're looking for. That's fine. Can we do can we do Baron? Can we do Baron? Can we do Baron? There we go. We just had to type a little bit. We just ping and type. Yeah, if Vayne's not going to do Baron, we're screwed. But she's doing Baron. Nice. That's our ADC. Pike's working one shot. Baron chunks now. Dude, do you hear that music? It's a little scary. We have Ash Arrow? I'm done to let it rip. Oh, wait, Kane. This is fine. We'll take a Kane. We got to look for Kane here. Okay, we got Kane. I'm blinded. It's fine. We got Teemo. Oh, no. I blind. No, 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 no. Oh, no. Fine. Pike cleans. Pike cleans. Pike cleans. Boom. Boom. Judas room. That's fine. One for one. All right. Could be worse. Not bad. Not bad. <coughs> Yo, that Teemo does some damage. I got melted. I mean, I guess Samira also did a lot of damage. I guess they all did a lot of damage. I lived 15 seconds, so I guess I didn't get melted, but I felt like I got melted. Dude, we, we're putting in so much work. This game's hard still, don't get me wrong, but we're putting in work. I'll wait for Jack Show. I get Jack Show to base, and I I think I get the Renook item last. Or, oh, sorry, on End of Despair. Like, this scales off my HP. Is there another item to go? I, I just fear that every seven seconds in combat feels like an eternity. It just feels so long. Is it ever is stone? Is stone plate removed? They removed stone plate, didn't they? Yeah, because that item was freaking dookie. I'm just trying to think if there's any other item. I don't think I'm missing anything. Like Starax, no. <clears throat> I don't need the damage. I would say Terminus might be okay, but I don't need the damage at all. Ooh, nice cocoon actually. That's a really good start to the fight. I don't see how we would lose this. Nice, okay, big damage. Zed's dead. I'm gonna go for Blitz. Get him! Come back, sir. Come back, you little rat. That's fine. This, nice, he does die too. Boom, boom, boom. Okay, Timo's not doing that much damage by himself. It's <laughs> just when you hit his freaking minefield. I was gonna eat this. Nice. The, tur the turret's literally healing me. 
Yeah, Jack Show is. I feel like I'm noticeably tankier now that I have the Jack Show. Yeah, that team, those team mushrooms are hurting. I, I would really like to get Drake really quick. I'm just gonna start it. It might not be a good decision. We're at 6k HP. Heart Steel's got me 800 health. Heart Steel's doing a lot of damage, 400. I'm just trying to think, what is my last tank item? I think it might actually just be Unending Despair. Is that the only thing left? They'd be nuts to try and steal this. You got no smite, homie. Oh, Kane does have smite. Oh, huge. I didn't expect you. I didn't expect her to hit that. Actually, I'm tanky, so I'm just buying. I'm buying time. I'm just autoing anybody and everybody. Hey, it's working out. I'm just autoing everybody. I'm unkillable. Vane cleaned everybody up. Hey, I'm just tanking. If y'all need me, I'm just a tank. I'm just a main tank if you need me. Hell yeah, that worked out great. All right, we're gaming. Sick. GGS. That's beautiful. 6k HP, 200 armor, 100 MR before before uh, Jack Show going. That was a beautiful game. Good arrows from Arthur. Beautiful. The heck? That was just a perfect game with my friend Arthur Lanches. Let's check out the stats here. I did a lot of damage. A lot of damage. Gotta honor the boy. Those two arrows were sick. 40k damage nice so we did 40k damage it was um let's see physical damage to champs boom it was 11k physical 27k magic so pretty heavy on the mr grass to 2300 wild conditioning overgrowth value 300 hp from overgrowth very nice and then our damage taken is insane right look freaking 53k damage taken and damage mitigated for my items 45k ggs freaking tank team of season 14 baby we are back with a one-shot Teemo build for Season 14. This build is going to be potentially the best build in games that you can use it. So I cube mid lane Teemo here because this build requires you to one-shot them, requires them not to have any magic resist. So what do we build to do that? You're going to go Sork Shoes, and our core build is going to be Storm Surge, Shadow Flame. Storm Surge, Shadow Flame. This is a new item, 100 AP, 12 magic pen, 5 move speed. Uh, if you do 35% of the champ's max health damage, you get movement speed and it does more damage. Shadow Flame now gives 120 AP, which is insane. 12 magic pen. So you see both these uh, items in combo with Sork Pooch. You have a lot of magic pen. So if the enemy champion is squishy, aka not building magic resist, you'll be able to one-shot them. Legit one-shot. It's super broken as well. Um, and then after, we're going to go Death Cap to capitalize on all that, all that AP. Look at my runes. We have Dark Harvest, Cheap Shot, Eyeball Clutch, and Treasure Hunter. Um, the classic, like, one-shot Teemo setup. Secondary is Absolute Focus, Gathering Swarm. Again, this build is the best build when you're able to get all that AP, when you're able to get fed, or if the enemy team doesn't have any MR. And it's easily the best build. It has, like, the most up, up, up time, up potential. It has the most potential. So, with that being said, I think Doran's Ring is the best starter nowadays since Doran's Ring got buffed. But with this build, it just relies on getting fed, right? So I am going to go for the Dark Seal. I'm also playing at mid lane because we want to be able to roam and impact the map and get kills, right? We don't want to be stuck 1v1 versus a volley bear. We want to be, oh, you know, roaming around and doing damage, getting those harvest stacks, getting snowballing with Dark Seal. So we ride. Ooh, okay, okay. Um, I didn't use any of my potions. They were on the wrong key. That's unfortunate. I definitely could have lived, by the way. But we'll take it. It could be worse. Yeah, I definitely could have lived if I used one of my freaking potions. I'm going to go Shadow Flame first, believe it or not. <laughs> because the Storm Surge, you had to do 35% of their health. I don't think you can do that as a first item. But Shadow Flame, 120 EP, 12 Magic Pen, and you crit below 35%. I'll, I'll take that, right? I can do that. I, I would, like, Nashers is a big question mark, right? Like, why do Nashers? I don't think with this build, how it's built, you're going to need the Nashers. I'm pretty sure, like, Nashers is still a good item, don't get me wrong. But with how this build's set up, we're looking just to get to that one-shot potential ASAP. Okay, this this guy is a Katarina main, right? Step on Daggers is their name. They, they're pretty decent. They're playing pretty decent. 
Pretty much, Katarina, you can fight her early. You're not going to stomp her or anything. Um, but I'm trying to fight her early and active. Oh, shit. I'm on my way. Ooh, okay. Do we still go? I'm kind of already here. We kind of have to go. Ramis, run this way! You only hook her, hook her. I'm going to go for cat. Uh, I just have to hit anybody I can, really. Do we have flash? Flash, there is flash. Oh, that's fine. I'm going to keep going for cat here. She's low, although she does have red buff. I want to keep leaning. Oh, no, 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 no. I got a harvest proc. If I can die for her, I'll take the one for one. Yeah, that's fine. I think I think she, I want her to stay. I want to fight this. I want to just kill her and die. Because if she misses the wave, it's super worth it. She doesn't die. I don't have a harvest proc. She doesn't die. Oh, no. That's not good. That's not good at all. I'll be honest. That's not good. That's not good whatsoever, guys. I thought she, I would I would take the one for one, but I didn't think she would live. No harvest proc. She got the level up and she has red buff. Huh, okay. Well, it's not going that early game, but we'll, we'll be okay. We'll be okay. It's fine. We can blame jungle for that one, right? We can blame jungle for that one or what? We had a we one for one, and uh, it's fine. It's fine. She got two kills there. Oh, no. She got two kills. I have the three harvest procs, but it's not ideal. I wanted to get the one for one. Unlucky level up. Unlucky. Uh, red buff. Ah, oh, unlucky. One, two, three, four. Uh, she's going to smoke me, but I still want to fight, to be honest. Well, this is not looking good anymore. Oh, sweet fucking god. It's not looking good. She came back with two kills and a blessing one. Just joinked me. It's fine. I'm on my way back. It's fine. One shutdown. We're good. It's fine. That red buff healing is so massive. That red early game red buff is nuts, isn't it? <coughs> early game red buff's a little nutty. That's okay. All good. We'll blame it on the jungle. Jungle diff. I mean, we got a one for one to start the game. Jungle diff. Honestly, the spot's really not that bad. If I can just get a couple kills and get some heart, get some dark seal stacks going, we're fine. Hats top. Good luck, guys. I'm gonna get some plates. I'm gonna get a platey. 125 golds. 125 gold. I'm just saying. That's half a kill. I'll take it. I'll take the half a kill. Oh, damn. They got the void nuggies. <coughs> Maybe we go pick on their bot lane. I'm down. Oh, sorry. I meant to do push. Oh, what if I just go for this? I have, I have ignite. I'll take that all day. Hey, it kills a kill. I miss a wave for it, but it's fine. I miss a cannon. It's not that fine. Oh, cats coming. Cats are coming. I feel like we stay and either we kill them or we get killed. Yeah, cats coming, but we're, we're going for it. Oh, fuck. All right, I just have to make sure I don't die. I think my team's going to get pentakilled. I have to make sure I don't die. This is... I don't think this is ideal. Okay. Honestly. Go! Go, Ramus, Go! Let's freaking go. It's winnable. We're back, baby. We're so back. We're so back. We're so back. We'll take it. We got that last auto in there. Huge, huge five stacks too. Five stack. Oh, we're so freaking back. Okay, now I can't die. Now I can't die. I got to preserve the stacks. I need all the precious AP I can get. I'm going to go, I'm going to get that large rod because like that large rod is the hardest to buy. I'll even start, I'll divvy up my build a little bit actually. That large rod is the hardest to buy. And I don't want to go with 800 gold in my pocket. So, divvy up the build. Still want to get Sork Boots, Shadow Bloom, Sork Boots, still priority. I got to catch a midway before roaming. 
Maybe Bach can come help us. Do we actually have the juice? We might not, but I'm down. Oh, this looks this looks freeze. Yeah. We get the burst Katarina, right? Nice. Okay, that's a freebie. Hell yeah. And we get Drake. Good job, Ramus. Good job, everybody. And I get Dark Seal stacks. I get another Dark Seal stack somehow? How do I get a Dark Seal stack on on way? How did I get a Dark Seal stack on the way? I'll take it. I'm not mad. I'm just I'm confused. Do I have enough for Shadow Flame? New Shadow Flame gold is different. 850. I don't even have enough. Alright, how fast is Cat? I think I should be able to get this plate at least. I still won't have enough gold though. I need I'm not gonna base without 800 gold at least. Like that would make Do I just do our blue buff? Do I just wait for a wave? I'm gonna do scuttle and then get another wave mid. I think cat's roaming bottom though. Yeah, cat's roaming bottom. They're dead. I gotta go shove mid. Maybe they're not dead. Maybe cat doesn't even kill Ramus. I'm just gonna shove mid regardless. I'm not gonna make it there. So if you're not gonna fight, you gotta shove. Does Zareth live? Zareth dies. That's okay though. Ramus dies. That's less okay. <clears throat> I get another plate though. I mean, like she got kills. It's not good, but I, at least I'm doing something about it, right? The best I could do there is get another plate. I committed to greeting for my item. That's okay though. We, we at least did something. The worst thing we could do is not doing anything at all. Just take a base instead of getting a plate. We're looking good. I got this. Boom. We're gonna keep building that storm surge. So now we have we have the base, right? That's the base damage. Now I get Swork Boots and then Storm Surge and we go we start one shotting, right? It's a little bit of a ramp. Like it isn't a, a late game build because like I'm already strong with Shadow Flame. But it's like it definitely you don't spawn at a base one shotting, so Nasher's Deathly is like the cleanest early, early game item. But again, this you ramp up really quickly. The attack speed really goes to waste with this. Storm Surge is incredibly broken, you'll see. Cat could roam bottom, but I don't see it actually working. I don't see why she would. I'm not going to get to top in time, so I'm just going to keep pushing mid lane. I think Cat's going bottom, but yeah, I don't think she's going to get anything. I'm going to push just in case. I want to make sure to early flash if she comes over here, because she can kill me. Yeah, I'm out. Is that going top, that Briar ult? It is. I'm on my way. I'm headed top. I could probably one ooh, she's gonna go for this. I'm gonna one shot her. I'm here. Wait, just wait, Ramus, patience, patience. He popped that Q a little too quick. I have ignite, we can kill, we kill. I, I didn't want to blow ignite. It's a little greedy, sure, but I didn't want to use my ignite there. Cat's going bottom. I didn't have to use my ignite on volley evidently either. But this is a banger. Cat's roaming, I'm roaming, we're all roaming. You're roaming, he's roaming. The Shadow Flame crit look cool. I get a plate. The name of the game is gold, right? Gold is the name of the game. And I've got a lot under my belt, this one. I get even more here. Too. This is just lucky, right? Luck of the draw, I get this top lane gold. <clears throat> we're looking good. Like I could get Mesh Eyes. If we pull off the Mesh Eyes, that'd be pretty epic. But I really want my Swork Boots. Can we pull off the Mesh Eyes? I guess Mesh Eyes? Mesh Eyes and that uh, Alternator looks like really good actually. So we'll do that. Because this builds into... Yeah, nice. Okay. I don't actually want to go top. Hey, Chef. I don't actually want to go top here. So I'm going to ping for Darius too. I'm not freaking leaning versus Yumi Volley. Sorry. With magic resist. So right now, like, I'm not one-shotting, but I'm chunking pretty hard. Everybody except Volley is getting chunked. I'm even down to go for this. Like, I'm, I'm at a point where, yeah. Do I get a harvest proc? Nice. Look at that. Volley put his anathemas on me. Like, what? Dude, I'm not going near you. I will take another plate. Don't mind me. Thank you. Briar ult could hurt here. Why is his anathemas on me? 
Briar's top. Okay, that's fine. The void grubs, the void. I like to call them the void nuggets. I'd like to get this full tower. I think I can as well. Ooh, that was a close call. I'll tell you that much. I gotta get out of here because Cat's gonna do her jumpies. I'm out. This poor Darius. Now we get our boots finally. Finally get those boots. <laughs> All right. So now, like I said, we're we're doing heavy damage to every everybody except Volley. I will admit, Volley is not going to... Oh, they're all buying MR, huh? They're all buying MR immediately, huh? Okay, we're still going to chunk since we're ahead, but we'll have to get an early Void. We're going to have to go Void Staff third since they're buying MR, which is fine. That's totally fine. So we're going to be one-shotting Wei and Yumi. Everybody else, we have to wait till Void. I don't want to tell Darius not to go bottom, but like, you know... He should be matching volley still. Like, it's not fun, sure, but it's like that is, you know, it is a top winner's role. But I, I don't want to tell him. Like, he's having a tough game. I kind of feel bad. Oh, is Cat coming? I forgot about Cat for half a second. We got to go. Cat rooms do be scary. Okay, we're out. Nice. Freebie. Take that. Oh, no. I got to get away from that dagger. Okay, I'm good. I'm alive by one HP. Got cat flash, too. That's scary. Now, that is terrifying. But we're alive. Where's Storm Surge at? Where you at? Okay. Whew. <coughs> that was a little nuts. Dunker. Press R. Way TP'd for that. Yeah, I was gonna say I would think Way's gonna keep pushing. Okay, I can one shot him so easily. We're at 334 AP as well. He's he should definitely push another wave after. I don't see why he would TP in base after one wave. We're gonna look for that. I'll, I'll set up one shroom there. There's my guy. Keep it coming. Keep it coming. A little bit closer. There we go. That's the damage. There it is. Not quite a one shot yet, but pretty damn close, right? Okay, I gotta be really. I have to respect Cat super hard. I would like to push another way, but I don't think I'm gonna disrespect her like that. I'm looking for 1400 gold. I need 14. Then at 1400 gold, now at, once we get 14, we're just gonna one shot everybody. The storm surge, like, is wild. I, okay, there's Cat, so I think I keep pushing bottom. I think I just keep bullying high. Oh, high. Way for my uh, my mid stack. Damn, that swing's a menace. I don't know if they're gonna make it to when I get storm surge. I'm, I'm, I don't know if they're gonna make it that far. Come on, way, come over here. Oh, way's mid, smart man. Oh, cat got a kill. Oh no, Darius shut down cat. Oh, good for Darius. He's not miserable then anymore. He's had a pretty tough game. Oh, Lord. Now we're... Okay. Listen, if they FF, I understand. FF boots are now three. You only need three instead of two. So, if they FF, I understand. The, the way is freaking 1 in 11, guys. This poor soul. Is that coming for me? Me or mid lane? Oh, I think we see where it is. The swing of old swing is not of old. Damn, the fade away. Oh, that's... <laughs> Wait, no, don't go for me. Don't go for me. I was kidding. Damn, that swing with the kiting. Oh, this volley's pissed. Wow, how toxic is that? That was the most toxic game I've ever seen. All right, so we have our core item. This is the core of the build, right? Now I just am, I'm, I'm going to one-tap anybody right now, and then it just keeps going from there, right? Next item is going to be void since they have a lot of magic resist, and then after that, death cap. Would be Death Cap before Void after that Lich Bane. Just all these items now really facilitate full AP Teemo because they all get so much AP. Lich Bane is 100 up from 80. Shadow Flame is 120 up from 100, right? Uh, Storm Surge is a whole new item. It has Magic Pen and 100 AP. So everything is just like super one shot Teemo friendly. Like I said, the only thing is you don't have Nashers. But again, we only rock this build versus certain team comps. It's best mid lane when you're versus certain team comps. The Dark Harvest can get rolling, right? When you're versus those champs that, that are one shotable. Because no Nashers does feel different, right? 
But again, when you can get this build online and you're versus the right team, it goes hard. We'll use this way. This way is level nine, um, but we'll use him as like a staple watch. I'm gonna auto queue, he's gonna explode if I can find him. Which we cannot. Oh, there he is, okay, boom. There it is, and then Storm Surge, watch Storm Surge. Boom, see that splat? That splat is Storm, st storm Surge. If you can do 35% of their HP, it does an extra 300 damage and gives you 30 gold. Uh, Swain's gonna go kill them, but I'm gonna get this. I'll go join Swain. Wall is a little bit tanky, so I don't think he's gonna one shot, but we can we can do it. We can kill him. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, we're dead. We're toast. Oh, we're toast. The way TP scared us. <coughs> oh no. Avenge me, avenge me, Swain. That guy's a little tanky at the moment, and he has a yum yums. That's okay, though. That's okay. We'll get him. We'll, Ray, we're just scaling. But we're just scaling a little bit. Dude, look at their magic resist. Guys, chill. Force of nature, wits, and Katarina. Like, okay. Merc treads. Guys. What's going on here? Darius, punish him. You're the only AD. You got this, dude. They are scaling, aren't they? Well, I'm surprised Volley actually pulled the trigger on that base. Ooh, Infernal Drake. We're going to stack some AP. This game might go on for a while. Our damage is going to be low until we get Void. And then when we get Void, it will jump right back up. These new buffs now, season 14, after 20 minutes, you see this little purple infusion, they're barren infused. So your whole team gets the buff. This also makes counter jungling that much better, right? Because if, if you take their their red, instead of their team whole team getting red, your whole team gets red. Um, Katarina's gonna be here too. Yeah, I gotta let you go. We can kill Cat though. I'm just gonna hit whoever I can and not die to the Katarina. Raid boss volley, chill. Nice. Oh shit. Okay, it's fine. I got blind, I got blind. Okay, never mind, I don't. Doink. Oh, one more auto. My storm surge did go off though. Get the Yumi, mine! Never mind, it's not mine. God, we are some bloodthirsty hounds for these kills. You see that? Fight for the cannon. Oh, he actually gave me the cannon, nice. I was in a, I was down to fight it out like a gladiator style. We are some bloodthirsty fiends for those kills. Holy smokes. That was fun. Get the Yumi. <coughs> Ouchies. Little Drake never hurt. Look at the raw amount of AP 440 at 22 minutes. These numbers are unheard of. It's season 14 at its finest. These numbers like we did not have these numbers before in season 13. Like I said, full AP Teemo, full AP is the name of the game, right? All the AP items got buffed. All the AP items, more AP, just for funsies. 120, 100. So if you compare last season to this season, these two items, this is plus 20 AP, and then this is plus 20, because 100 AP is pretty wicked for a mythic. So already at plus 40, right? Just for existing in season 14. Ooh. Her ult doesn't completely reset, right? Oh, she is. She is. I forgot. She is freaking wits end, man. Ah, uh, she is wits end and merc treads. I forgot. Until I get that void staff, my damage is going to be lower. I forgot about that. We got a ball game. I'll tell you that much. <clears throat> I don't think they can do Baron. We have a ball game. We do. We have a ball game. Their MR stacking is is crazy. Thank you, Lips. He's pretty he's a tanky boy. Ramus to save the taunt! And Swain heals off that. Volley doesn't have the juice. Well Cat does. I'll tell you what, Cat has the juice. Huge. Damn, season 14 Swain, okay. I'm on my way, I have blind, I have blind. Dude, this volley Yumi is insane. 
Look at this poor Way. Way just got caught in the crossfire. Huge. I'm putting shrooms down. What is that healing? Bro, he's a raid boss with this magic resist. What is this? He's not dying. Somebody hurt him. <laughs> what is this? Raid boss volley, man. We need freaking. We need Grievous Wounds. Storm Surge, boom. Storm Surge. We need Grievous Wounds ASAP. What was that? <laughs> yeah, someone's got to get Grievous. We don't have a single Grievous. Jesus. The Yumi. Is Yumi back for season 14? That did not look balanced. Hacking easily kill us. Oh, well, I think, I think we found her. I think I'll leave. <clears throat> So we need Void Stab, now we need Grievous as well, which also got buffed, by the way. Morello got buffed. It's only 2,200 gold. That's nothing. Of course, I don't have that gold right now, but 2,200 is relatively nothing. Who's buying Grievous? Hmm. Does anyone have it? Ramus has it, but why would Volley hit Ramus? I, I guess I'll have to go for it. 22, this is way better, though. 90 ability power, 15 haste, 2,200 gold. That's actually so cheap. I wonder if this is worth it just without even worrying about the Grievous. <laughs> 2200 is insanely cheap for 90 AP. Darius Fowler to me. We need Swain, I think. Swain is close. Swain is nearby. I'm, I'm flashing just in case. I don't want to die to this guy. He just freaking latched onto me. Darius left the game. He's like, I didn't get the kill either. Later, loser. See, I would love to go death cap here, right? If we go death cap, I'm gonna have like near a thousand AP because of the multipliers. <laughs> but I gotta, I gotta be a team player. Gotta get that grievous. Gotta get that grievous to the squad for the volley. With Darius leaving, I feel like we, we actually have have a ball game now. See, look, I got red buff because Ramus did it. And then all my team gets blue because I did it. <coughs> now, if we can take his red, we can deny them red buff on all their champs. I don't think she's alone, is she? I don't know if I want to risk this because we, we saw Katarina. Uh, I didn't want to risk it. I could have, but I didn't want to. Probably should be careful up here, because I would think Katarina was skulking at that red. You're gonna go right to top after me. Gotta be a little careful. Yeah, there's the volume. Yeah, how close of, how close of a call was that? Jesus. Katarina was skulking too, right there. Alright, Swain's so 91 and 11. What a beast. All right, I can go one shot away. Wayne, and Yumi are the only people left that I can actually just like auto queue one tap. But I mean, in a, like I said, in a game where they don't all buy freaking loads of magic resist, this one tapping is way more common. But I'll show you, I'll show you the, the power. Here we go. Come here, Way. Come here, make it easy. Boom, auto queue, auto. There it is. Storm Surge, we're, sur we're, we're surging. Storm Surge, we're surging. Auto Q, auto, boom. Boom, what up? Uh, I think I'm not going to join the fight. I think I'm going to hard push. Good luck, guys. Oh, that Zerath just got picked like a booger. Volley's going to push. I'm going to push. I think I can. I think I actually push faster. I'm not going to lie. Volley, you, me. I think I push faster. And my team can hold. We have to be careful for. I have to be careful of just cat when or way when he's when way spawns. <laughs> Eight seconds, but I, I don't really have to be careful. Way it's not that scary. I'll look for a turret at least. If I can, oh, I just use my shroom. Damn, I was gonna say if I can nail him with a shroom, I could probably one tap him. If I can get an auto Q auto with ignite, I can one tap tap him as well. I have eight seconds. I'll go for it. Ah, he got the flash off. Nice. Almost. Look at that. Almost. The Storm Surge almost got him. Katarina, chill? Okay, I'm on my way, team. Is Cat really going to follow me all the way? It's going to be close. Oh, freaking way. The way TP. Nice. I'm just going to run. I'm just going to die. 
Oh, way TP'd behind me like a little rat that he is. I didn't even look. I was so focused on Katarina. This little rat. This freaking 1 in 16 way just TP behind me like the beast that he is. It was a good TP. It's just like a little rat is what he is. God damn it. Our Darius save case. We have a ball game, don't we? we our Darius is pissed. He's like, I'm not playing this no more. That's a ball game. We got a ball game. We got a ball game. It's a meat the ball. It's a ball game. I'm going to commit to the full Grievous. So this is pretty interesting. Season 13, Morello Lamacon was a sack of crap, right? It was a turd. Um, but now it's actually decent, right? This is the first time I I bought full Morello in like a year. Because like before, how much was it? It was 3,000 gold. You would get AP haste. No, yeah, you would get AP haste. You get the Grievous wounds and get health. But like, why do I? I don't want to pay for health, right? Did they just two-man Baron? Okay, the two-man Baron. Okay, that's fine. Uh, I don't want to pay like five million gold for health, right? I just want the Gro you buy Morello because you want the Grievous wounds. Ramus, I got this, brother. Let me I got this. I got this. Let me just get a little. Thank you. I didn't get the storm surge off, but that's okay. Ooh, good luck, team. If Katarina's there. Do we actually pinch this? I think we do. Oh. Um, that's fine. She's going to get Storm Surge. Our team died, though. We're just going to keep going. Maybe Katarina forgets the base and I can end the game. If she forgets the base, I can potentially end. I think she's going to base, though, isn't she? Why would she not base? She's not dumb. I'm, I'm, I'm coming on my way. I got this. We'll probably go Death Cap last item then. All right, so it's just Volley Yumi. But I don't think we... I mean, I have, I have Grievous and, and Void Staff. Kind of down. Oh, no. I walked too far forward. Oh, he still has ultimate, man. He still has ult. Our whole team's dead, but he still has ultimate? What the scam is that? Ram is just eating... Volley's just eating away at the turrets. He doesn't care. The Volley Yumi. <laughs> He's still an ultimate. Gosh darn it. <clears throat> All right. It's going to be death cap last item. I think Swain should have enough juice. To, we don't have Grievous. I guess he's, he's Grievous from autoing Ramus, right? He keeps autoing Ramus, which puts the Grievous on him. That's good. Unless Ramus dies, or unless Cat shows up. Oh, that's not good. Dude, this Volley Yumi pairing is super raid boss level. Oh, that's not good. Oh, that's not good. They can end the game. The game's over. We lost. It's okay. We're still we're still storm surging. Yeah. Um. You know what? Like I said, we're still swarm surging. This item is this build is this build still broken. Okay, they have a freaking Bali Yumi that just went full raid boss, and our Darius left the game. That doesn't. It literally doesn't count. We're still gaming. I don't care. DJ, the way went one in seventeen. <laughs> GG. Yumi's back, baby. Yumi is back. Let's check out the damage done. I think Swain might have me beat for a while. He was freaking... They were swimming in his ult. But I still packed a nice punch. That Zero skin is, is sweet. Okay, 38k. I actually was comparable to Swain, which is surprising. The volley obviously went sicko mode. 27 harvest procs, 2400 damage, 14 cheap shot, absolute focus, gathering storm, cool, full AP, Teemo. This game, we are playing split push Teemo in season 14. So they removed the, the mythic requirements. So now we get to go ahead and build any items we want. So we're going to be able to go Triforce and abuse a spell blade. Holebreaker also got changed. Holebreaker is now you get five autos and it does extra damage to everything. Monsters, turrets, champions, right? So that's going to be awesome. 
And then we're going to finish off with a Rage Blade. That's going to be our build. New split push team in season 14. Check the room page. Of course, we're going Demolish. Of course, we're going Lethal Tempo for the attack speed. Let's game. We're at Belveth top, so that's, you know, that's workable. Any auto attack based champion will, will team will be good in twos, so. We're going to be splitting all game, just melting the turrets like paper. It should go really well. She is Ignite, so I don't think this is that. Okay, I was going to say, I don't think I'm going to kill her that easily. She, I mean, she almost killed me even with, and she didn't even use Ignite. So, like, Belveth is that sneaky champion. That looked simple, but, I mean, if she got an extra level or another proc off, I might have died. But, yeah, she's trolling. That's fine. Korean challenger player, all good. I understand. I'm going to TP whenever she shows up. I rock TP on the split push build. I mean, TP is the best summoner spell in the game, right? Let's be honest. Is she not TPing? I'm going to TP her. Oh, there, there, there she is. You know, I'll, I'll, I'll flash. That's fine. I live. Okay, thank God. I put, I, I put that pot. Okay. We'll take that. She kind of scared me. Thank God I potted. Thank God I ran away. I'm going to go... Let's go ahead and, and sauce it up. I'm going to get Cole second. I'm also going to... Um, 